welcome to this week's preschool story time. I'm Miss Jessica, and since Valentine's Day is coming up this Sunday, I thought I would read you a book about love. So the book I'm going to read today is called Love the World. What do you think it means to love the world? Let's find out what happens in this story. Love the World by Todd Parr. Love the world. Love your face. Love your space. What kind of house do they live in? Love your nose. Can you touch your nose? Love your toes. Can you wiggle your toes? Love your eyes and love your size. Love your walk. Who's walking on this page? Can you walk like a crab? Love your talk. This says, I love you. Love giving a hand. They're having a food drive to help out these dogs. Love taking a stand. This says, welcome friends. Love yourself. Love the world. Do you see the world on this page? Can you point to it? Right there. Love the bees and love the trees. Love your ears. Can you touch your ears? Love your tears. This guy's crying, but he says, I feel better. Love your hair. Love your flair. They say, bah, bah. Love being kind. What does it mean to be kind? Being kind means being nice to other people. This is an animal shelter, and they're saying goodbye because he just adopted a dog. Love using your mind. She's building a robot. Wow. Can you build a robot? Love making art. And love sharing your heart. Who is someone that you like to share your heart with? Who's he sharing his heart with on this page? Love yourself. Love the world. Love your giggle. That's kind of like your laugh. She says, ha ha, he he. Love your wiggle. Can you wiggle like a worm? Let me see it. Good job. Love your grin. Grin is another word for smile. Love your skin. Love the land. And love the sea. Love the earth, love you and me. Love yourself, love the world. What's something that you love? Can you 
that's the end of our book today, Love the World. Thank you for joining me for this week's preschool story time. Next week on Monday, we're starting our Raising a Reader program. So we'll still be posting a story every Monday at 11 on Facebook. See you then. Bye.